name is Zach. I'm a SolidWorks support tech with GoEngineer. And one of the questions we get from time to time is how do I add annotations to blocks? So if you've ever made blocks in SolidWorks, then you probably already know there's a limitation to what types of annotations you can put in a block. However, I found a workaround for this and I'd like to share it with you. So to demonstrate, I'm going to try to make a block out of this simple sketch that I created directly on my drawing where I have included a dimension and a weld symbol. So I'm going to just window select around everything and right click and choose make block. At this point, you can change the insertion point by clicking the drag manipulator and changing the location. We can click OK and you'll notice that SOLIDWORKS did make the block and include the dimension, but it omitted the weld symbol. So the workaround for this is going to be to create a drawing view and then convert that view to a sketch. So what I've done is just started drawing directly on my drawing without being in a view. So I'm going to have to create a view for this and copy and paste my sketch geometry and place it into that view. I'm just going to hit undo a couple times to get this back to where it was. And from here, we'll go to insert, drawing view, click predefined view. What this does will just allow me to place an empty view anywhere on my drawing. And as I said before, I'm just going to copy and paste or actually cut and paste this geometry into that view. So I'm going to window select everything. I'm going to hold control X down on my keyboard. Then I'm going to double click this view to lock view focus. And what that does is when I paste this geometry into that view, it's going to stay with that view. So to paste the geometry, I want to hold control down and V as in Victor on my keyboard to paste. And I want my dimension shot way off here. So I'm going to fix that real quick. So what we're going to do here is actually convert this entire view now to a block. And you can do this on any view. So you could have a model view actually referencing model geometry and you can convert that entire view to a block. It will convert everything in that view, including all annotations. So what we're going to do is right click, going to choose convert view to sketch. Then in the property manager, you have one of these selections is replace view with block. And again, you can change the insertion point if you want to. I'm not going to mess with that right now. I'm just going to hit OK. And wait a little bit and then you'll see that SOLIDWORKS did in fact create a block out of that entire view. So the one caveat to this is that it did convert everything in the view to a sketch before it converted it to a block. So pretty much any attempts to explode the block and still have functional annotations will be futile. But anyway, I hope this video has been informative to you and thank you for watching.